You see it on the page. Book of Zood and Softening Hearts. You find find it in what? Sahih Muslim here. Sahih Muslim 3004. Sahih Muslim 3004. This is where you find this particular hadith I'm talking about. Now the hadith says, uh, sorry, the hadith narrates, it says, Hadab bin Khalid al-Azdi told us, Hamman narrated to us. Then he says, on the authority of Zaid bin Aslam, on the authority of Atta bin Yasser, Abu Said Khudir reported that Allah's messenger said, now look at this all trash garbage is here. We don't see on the authority of the prophet. We don't see on the authority of God even. We don't see God here. We don't see the, on the authority of, of the prophet himself. We don't see anything like that. We only see on the authority of these imposters. They are all imposters. Now, then they said, Allah's messenger said, we all know the message given to Muhammad as a prophet and a messenger was the Quran. Quran chapter 47 verse 2 bears witness to that. Quran chapter 5 verse 67 also bears witness to that, that the Quran was the only message given to the prophet and the messenger. So now the messenger said, do not write. Do you see? He says, do not write anything from me. And whoever writes from me other than the Quran, he should efface it. That is, he should efface that. Wipe it out. If you write anything other than the Quran from him, right? Wipe, wipe it out. We cannot classify Hadith narrations as the Quran. It's not part of it. The Quran on its own is the Hadith, is the real Hadith as a matter of fact. So if somebody says you are an Hadith rejecter or the Hadith rejecter, just laugh at him because the Quran is the authentic and original Hadith. So if you call me Hadith rejecter, automatically, are you trying to say there is a Hadith better than the Quran? No way. I don't reject the Quran. So I should rather be calling the Mushriks Hadith rejectors. Because they reject the hadith of the Quran. So the prophet, according to their garbage books, the prophet is saying, do not write anything from me except the Quran, right? Because he said, whoever writes anything from him except the Quran should wipe it out, should efface that. And narrate from me. This narrate from me, if you break it down in hadith, means hadithu. You can say hadithu or hadithu. Narrate from me doesn't mean write hadith from me. Hey, do you see the difference? The, the, the command says, do not write for every intellectual person listening to me. The word write, he told them clearly. La taktubu anni gaira al Quran. La taktubu. He says, do not write from me except the Quran, other than the Quran. So Hadith books, the so-called garbage Hadith books, were they written down? The answer is yes. Are they written down? The answer is yes. So if they are written down, are they, these people actually listening to the prophet talking or are they deaf and dumb? He said, do not write. Did we see the Quran written down today? Yes, it's written down. We have it today. Why are these garbage hadith books also written down? Who gave them that authority? Now, let, let me tell you how the scholars will play with your conscience. In the same hadith, after he said, do not write anything down other than the Quran, if you write anything, wipe it out, efface it, then they will go to the last portion of the hadith, and then it says, wahadithu anni. Hadithu anni, narrate from me, doesn't mean write it down from me. You see how dumb some of the Scholars can make you. If I say narrate something from me, doesn't mean I say write it down. When you are narrating something from me, meaning if I have given a command, you can narrate that same command from me to people. Because it's only the Quran which has been permitted to be written down. Nothing else. 
the devious scholars will try to formulate things and tell you, oh, you know what? Uh, after this time, the prophet gave, because anyways, there are these books are garbage books anyways. I'm not quoting this hadith to tell you I believe in them. No, I'm only telling you the contradictive parts of their hadith books. So if the prophet said, do not write anything from me, that if you write anything, wipe it out, why do we have hadith books today? The reference is Sahih Muslim 3004. Write it down for yourself and go investigate for yourself. As simple as it is. Right? Aha. Uh -huh.